CataractCoach.com, teach me about diamond blades. You know, diamond keratomas make the best incisions. Here's why. Now, I'm going to show you this whole case start to finish. It's five minutes, so hang in there with me. But I've been using diamond keratomas for many, many years. And the reason is they're the best for making a phaco incision. Now, a diamond keratome is many times sharper than a steel keratome. So the steel blades are just good, but the diamond keratomes are much better. Because they're so much sharper, the incision that they make is much cleaner. It seals better and heals faster. So there's the diamond keratome. Watch carefully. We'll make a nice single plane incision, good tunnel length. That's beautiful. Even roof compared to the, the floor of the incision, the architecture is great. That incision is going to seal optimally. Now, you can make the incision in essentially three different ways. One, you can use a steel blade or steel keratome, and that certainly works well. And you can use a diamond keratome, which I've shown you here, and that's going to be the best of all because it's absolutely the sharpest and makes the absolute cleanest incision. And the third technique is you can use a laser. You can use a femtosecond laser. Now, I know patients love the word laser and they hear laser, but let me tell you, of the many dozens of ophthalmologists on whom I've operated, not one has said, oh, you must use the femtosecond laser for my cataract surgery. No. I've shown you videos here in Cataract Coach of multiple ophthalmologists having surgery with me. There are, I've operated on cataract surgeons who've done more cataract surgery than I've done. And all of them have chosen a diamond keratome. It's not enough for my eyes. Make the incision with a diamond. So the reason behind the diamond keratome is the diamond is ultra hard, right? I mean, it's the hardest thing on most scale of hardness. Diamond from 1 to 10 is a 10. Nothing else is even close. And so you can make a diamond keratome really sharp. The edges can be infinitely small or thin. And that allows us to make a very precise incision. Remember, the eye is like an underinflated balloon. I mean, what's the normal eye pressure? 15, 16, 18 millimeters of mercury? That's pretty soft. So to make an incision in an underinflated balloon, you need a very, very sharp instrument. And the diamond keratomes are absolutely the sharpest. So for my patients, when I do surgery in Beverly Hills, I use a diamond keratome. Now, I certainly can use a steel keratome, and you've seen many videos of me doing that in other locations. But in Beverly Hills, it's only diamond keratome. And if I was going to have surgery on my own eyes tomorrow, I'd tell the surgeon, please, uh, use a diamond keratome for me. The femtosecond laser can make a reasonable incision, but let's be straight here. It's not even nearly as good as what you can make with a diamond keratome. And this is why you see most surgeons, in my experience, who use a femtosecond laser for cataract surgery, they don't use that laser to make the incisions because it's just not as good as using a steel keratome and not even close to being good as using a diamond keratome. So this is why I like the diamond keratome. Now there's some disadvantages. The diamond keratomes are super fragile. These things are incredibly thin and I know diamonds are hard, but if you touch the tip of a diamond keratome or diamond blade with a steel or titanium instrument, you're going to chip it. You're going to damage it. Diamond keratomes are also really expensive. You're looking at, at a minimum $5,000 per diamond keratome, maybe even six, eight, or $10,000 for the one instrument. So why is it that if you look at my videos, I have multiple trays of multiple diamond, diamond blades. Why have I spent 50, 60, $80,000 on diamond keratomes? Because I really do believe, in fact, you believe too, that they make the absolute best incisions. And I want to give my patients that same high level of care 
that I would want for my own eye. So in the future, when I have a cataract surgery in 20 years or 30 years, who knows when, I want that surgeon to use a diamond keratome to make a beautiful incision that'll be super clean and it'll seal well and give me a beautiful result and incredible vision for the rest of my life. And I want to give that to all my patients. Thanks for watching these videos. And remember to go to cataractcoach.com and sign up for a free daily email. We'll send you an email every day with a great video like this and other surgical pearls that'll make you a better surgeon.